Man, the street is so beautiful. It's cool. Hey everybody, I'm Dave, great to be with you. I hope this finds you happy and healthy. Now, before we get into today's video, I have to address a long running controversy about how to even say the name of the city where we are today. It's spelled N-O-R-F-O-L-K, but almost nobody around here says Norfolk. Most people, like me, say Norfolk. F-I-K. Some of the old timers even pronounce it Nafik, N-A-H-F-I-K. Hey, regardless of how you say it, we know what you're talking about. We are in Norfolk, Virginia today. So part of the challenge of doing a travel video in a city where I go to almost every day and have for about 21 years is that nothing's really new anymore in the city. The bloom is kind of off the rose. So today I'm going to try to only go to places I've never been before or in the case of the Wyanoke Bird and Wildlife Sanctuary I've never even heard of before. I guess you just walk, walk right in. I'm right now kind of blown away. I mean, there's a, a neighborhood that's right over there. There's an industrial area that's right over there. And then there's like this oasis back here. Guess they knew I was coming. Well, I don't know how many people come here outside of this neighborhood that's over there, but this was a pleasant surprise. Man, I love that spot. It's absolutely beautiful. For a city of its size, Norfolk has a huge arts community, which is great because now we get to go watch people blow glass. Come on. I need to get our blacksmith from the last video to talk to these folks. I, I think they'd have a lot to talk about. That was awesome. All right, so I'm not a big sweets guy, kind of try to avoid them, but everybody keeps telling me that I have to go to this place. I'm not sure I'm gonna say it right. Bon Bon Veneer. All I know is the sign out front says, chocolates, cakes, and more. Gotta do it. Okay, so I'm not sure how I said it outside, but the way I should have said it is Bon Bonier. This is Lisa, and Lisa owns Bon Bonier. So you're a confectioner, right? I am, yes. I've never met a confectioner. <laughs> and of course, the whole point of this video is doing things I haven't done in Norfolk and meeting people I haven't met. So what is your favorite thing in Bon Bonier? Um, to do or to make? To make, to eat. Oh, see, that's different answers. Yeah, um, probably favorite thing to make is the humdinger. The humdinger, that's yeah. the big cookie thing with the marshmallow Yeah, stuff the in. molasses yeah. cookies with the marshmallow and the chocolate. Yeah. Um, probably the favorite thing to eat that yeah. we make is the Spitfire. Mm -hmm. Okay, and yep. you gave me a... A mermaid truffle. A mermaid truffle. Yep. All right, we gotta get this, this is gonna show. Mm, mermaid yep. truffle. Got her upside down. I got it upside down? Uh-huh, you did, you put her upside down, that's okay. I'm sorry I had it upside down. <laughs> it's delicious, right side up or upside down. <laughs> Look at that, it is 77 degrees outside, and it's February. Which reminds me, I don't think I've ever been to the beach in Norfolk before. God, what a perfect day. Sun's out, it's nice and warm, not too many people here, of course. I'm wearing jeans and boots.
shout out to the folks here at the Thirsty Camel in Ocean View. It's an institution. It's only 2.30. I've got a lot of video to shoot. I, I better not. Okay, it's lunchtime. Now, Norfolk has turned into quite the foodie town, and it would be hard for me to come up with one, even ten restaurants that would highlight the food scene in Norfolk. So, given the theme of this video, I'm gonna try something I've never tried before, and that's a Filipino restaurant. Maymar was recommended. Let's go check it out. Uh, what is this over here? It's chicken and double. Chicken what? Chicken and double. All right, well, I'm certainly had lumpia before. Is it lumpia, lumpia, potato, potato? And this is the best I've ever had. Also, the uh, pancit is great. Um, I'm not sure what this chicken dish is, but this is also great. It's all just delicious. Fantastic lunch. Check out Maymar, East Princess Anne Road in Norfolk. Thanks. So one of the places I'm almost embarrassed to admit that I've never been is the Hermitage Gardens and Museum. I didn't even exactly know what it was. House dates back to the early 1900s. Uh, now it's an art museum and it is just a beautifully classically structured house and they have 12 acres here, gardens and millstones. Let's go look around. Look at this, what is that? It's like some big vine house. It's like something from The Hobbit or that Nicolas Cage movie, Wicker Man. Oh, you can go inside. Yet another place in Norfolk I have spent most of my life missing out on, the Hermitage Gardens and Museum. It's just, I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous here. By the way, you're not allowed to shoot video inside the museum, which is why I didn't take you in there. Uh, there's a small fee for that, $8 for admission, but they do give you a discount for AAA military and I think people who subscribe to my YouTube channel. You don't see a house like that very often. All right, last stop on our whirlwind tour of Norfolk on this beautiful Saturday is the Birch Bar. It's in the new Chelsea section of Norfolk. Voted one of the top 10 beer bars in the United States. And because it's a beautiful day, I'm thinking it's probably gonna be packed. All right, so the, uh, the Birch Bar, this place is cool. Make sure to check it out. Uh, that is it for our video. We barely skimmed the surface of Norfolk, but hopefully this kind of sends you on the path. Thanks for checking us out, and thanks for subscribing, and we'll see you next time.